Hi, I'm Brody. And I'm Andrew. And welcome back to the Double Gym Podcast. Double Gym Podcast. Wow. <laughs> Andrew will be keep telling us what we're going to be doing today. Okay. Uh, if you guys were here last episode, last episode we did yoga, and today we're going to be we're doing resistance training. If you do not know what resistance training is, let me give a simple definition. Resistance training it increases muscle strength by making your muscles work against the weight or force. Different forms of resistance training include using free weights, using machines, resistance bands, or your own body weight. A beginner needs to train two or three times per week to gain maximum benefit. Are you looking at your tablet or your phone? Uh, totally not. Actually, looking at the definition. No. Nope. You're looking at the definition right now. No, I'm not. Anyway, today, uh, you got if you guys watch the podcast, you already know we need our sweatband, nice and hot, right out of the microwave. I I I do a minute, but you can do longer or shorter if you want. And with our daily drink, we have we have ice pot ice pot pine for that. Cristiano Ronaldo. Brody, I just did the most stupid thing ever, and you're gonna see how stupid it is when you watch the video. You're gonna see how stupid it is when you watch the episode. Yes, I will. Yes, it is it's probably so stupid. I'm going to have to clean this up. Now then, let's start off with... Yeah, you're stupid. Okay, watch. Let's start off with what we did last episode. But that's why floor is will be easier for me. But it's the last thing we did last episode, but it's a good warm-up. Uh, if you watched last episode, you don't need any training, you just watch me. But if you didn't watch last episode, it's very simple. You're kicking back like a horse. But today, since we did it last episode, we're going to do it a little faster today. Because most people are on spring break, I'd recommend training on Sundays, unless you have church. If you have church, then you can do it on Monday. But after spring break, then we're going to go back to our usual schedule. Brody will be guiding us in our next activity. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. My head was somewhere else. I don't know where it is. Okay. So, we're just going to be doing some squats because that's pretty much the only workout I know. And it's also really good for resistance. So, let's go ahead and start off with 35 squats because I feel like we've made it about to that point. Okay. Because we're on episode 6, and if you've been following us, I think... Yeah, I think 35 would be a good limit for today. Alright. Uh-huh. Starting now, go at your own pace at home, but make sure you do at least 35. Uh-huh. I'm getting a lot of people telling me that that since it's a podcast, we don't talk about, we don't like talk much. But like, the thing about a podcast is we're like teaching you stuff. So like, if you would, maybe next few episodes, if you, I'll leave up a community because I always leave up 
community that the episode, and I'll ask you guys what what um what um what and just ask us some questions about Jim that we can read off here. Yeah, of course, answer. And I actually have one with me, so I'm go we're going to answer this question. Okay. Let me go into my community tab because I asked you guys last week, and we're going to see what you what you guys ask. We will be asking we will be answering two questions a day. So make sure to put your questions on the community tab, and we will be answering them. Yeah. All right. So let me look at the Double Jim podcast questions. See, it's it's underneath our did the next ep- did this episode help you? It always it's always underneath it. Anyways, first question we got. Um, it well, it's not it's more of a comment, but it's like yeah, it's by the Wheel Cartman. He says, yeah, but all my friends are calling me fat. Thing is, I'm not fat. I'm just big bones. What do I do? Keep watching our videos and, and eat nothing but egg yolks. Yeah, bro, you got milk. You got girl. <laughs> Not even just don't eat any other don't eat any of any other part of the egg, just the yolk. Okay. <laughs> Next question and last question for today. Um, let's see. Hi, I've I've been watching the Double Dream podcast since episode one, and I have a serious question. Okay? Let's see. I, I'm always motivated to do gym workouts, but I don't have enough equipment, and I'm also low motivation, so I don't want to do it. What is your advice? Okay. okay. For low motivation, I recommend getting a first. gym buddy. For low motivation, because if you have a gym buddy, it's very simple when you're working out by yourself, just to say that you don't want to work out that day. But if you have a gym, somebody waiting on you to work it out with the, at the gym with you, then you'll be motivated to do it. And then your other question was about equipment. Also, music. Yes. Your other question was about equipment. What did we say, people? Um, you second, don't let need me equipment. This one. Let me As you this notice one. from a lot of these episodes, we don't use equipment. All you really need is a few workouts. Yes, but we said it in the first episode, people. You we said it in the first equipment. episode, people. Yeah, we did. We said it literally in the first episode. Yeah. Yeah, you do not need equipment. You just need a few good leg and arm workouts, and you should be good. Brody, you can do your comments yeah. on this. I, I, Brody, I'll ask Brody one more question, and this one's for you. Because I saw one specifically for you. This question says, this question says, PD plus Rana. I noticed from the first two episodes that you were very big. How do I get like you? Two years of your life eating biscuits <laughs> and just if any don't let people mess with you if anybody if anybody is messing with you like in episode two do what I do what I do use self-defense don't like don't let anybody walk all over you That's just, yeah because yeah I don't know how it is. I'm 12 years old, 180 pounds, uh, half of it is muscle, and I'm five foot seven. I don't know. I think I'm just like naturally giant. I would say because literally everywhere I go, look at look up at me like they're looking up at like a six foot tall person. I'm almost six foot actually, because I'm only five foot seven. But seriously, but yeah, just. Do what you can. Like, what's Here's it called? Here's your advice. If you want to get like him, watch the Double Gym podcast. eat a little bit and work out. I would stay away from mostly carbs. Because carbs build a lot of fat. Yeah. But that is how you get big like me. Big. Alright. All right. So that was our Q&A portion of the podcast. You know, because it's a podcast. If you, um, after this episode, we will be releasing a poll on my community tab asking if you guys have any questions about the podcast, and we will be glad to help and answer your questions going on through the episode. And if your question doesn't get answered, then there's a the next also, episode. Also, guys, we're going to be making a poll asking what time, what are some, like, 
topics we should bring up in the videos. Like, tell us what you think some topics are that we should do in videos, like certain topics. Yeah. All right. So now we're going to go into our main part, which is core. For our first course, we are going to be doing push-ups against the wall. So if you have a wall near you, if you don't have a wall near you, mm -hmm. you can check this one out. Um, stay stagger with like a dog, but um, and wait for the next exercise. But this one, if you have a wall near you, put your hands against that wall and put your legs as far back as you can. Push your legs in, like push your knees in, and then push your hands forward. Now this one is a little hard. It's a little harder than normal push-ups. But it is good for your body. You do this about 10 times. You should be good. You look a little like that. Okay. There. Okay. This next exercise is going to be guided by me. Okay. So, we are going to be doing some kind of resistance, but kind of not. So, you want to be in that same position that Andrew told you with your back. Make sure your butt is touching the wall. Then, you want to bend over as far as you can because... You're going to end up falling a little bit, but right before you, you get to that point where you fall. Mm. We'll do uh, this about... Please don't be weird, leave we'll weird this. comments that I'm sick. We're probably going to do this about ten times because it is a little tough. Mm. Shit. Whoa! Whoa! See, you're gonna fall like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jesus, that's hard. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Alright, we've already done this exercise in two whole episodes. This will be our third. But the reason we've done it in two whole episodes is because this is one of the best exercises I know. And Brody, you should already know it, and people, you should already know it. Take your hands, put them against your legs. You know what we're doing. We're doing the pushback. Take your hands, grab the bottom of your feet, and you know what to do from here. Uh huh. If you've been staying with this podcast, you should already know this move. Uh huh. Just about 10 times as usual. We'll add up to 15 today. Usually we do non-stop to where you do it until your body tells you you can't anymore. And sometimes we will be talking on the next episode about how to do a flip while you're doing these. So you're like, go backwards and then you flip. But we're going to be looking more on that in the next episode. Mm hmm Alright. Alright, I think we can do a few more exercises. Alright. We've done this one episode before, but we're going to do it in this episode as well. Get the largest and heaviest object near you. Also, just ask, guys, this is back to, like, the pole thing. Ask, guys, which, which drink should we, should we talk about next episode? Prime or body armor? We're going to make a pole. Okay. So now that you got the largest and heaviest object, as we said to get about 20 seconds ago, you want to lay flat on your back. If you just 
sweat training like you just might get a little wet, but it's okay. Because wet is better for you. So you want to put your hands on the bottom of it and just poke up as many times as you can with this heavy object until you can't do it anymore. So the final thing, wait, are you done, Andrew? Yes. Okay. So the final thing I want to start doing for all of our episodes is at the end of the episode, everybody does a lap around their house. A lap around the house? One or two laps? Let's start off with one. Like, actually go outside and do a lap around the house. Hmm. That'd be a little hard, don't you think? Yeah, but you can, like, leave the camera somewhere there. Ooh, I have an idea. How about we walk around our house? Like, lap around our house five times. Yeah, that's better. We'll lap around your house five times. That's and we'll better. be back. Lap, uh, people at home lap in three, two, one, go. One. Okay. One. Four. Four. One last one. <laughs> Five. Woo. Five. All right. 
Our house is a little bit more. You want to try it for a second? You know what? We were like, we're going to try it for a second. Just breathe. I gotta get a juicy picture of you. I'm trying to find one. One second, I'm trying to find a picture of you. Perfect. He doesn't know what picture I'm about to fist bump, but here it is. Alright. You know, you just, just bit off feet with the intro so many times. I just wanna punch you. I wanna punch you so hard. Double Jim Podcast! Double Jim Podcast! Double Jim Podcast! Double Jim Podcast! Double Jim Podcast!